like I took out the half a little bit. Okay, so I got the next strut bars on. Now, one of the screws is misaligned a bit. So I'll have to either open that up or leave it like that because that's a sense terminal. It's not that important, but I would like that cell to be able to uh, equilibrate. Although it's probably doing it through the contact because these other screws are pushing it down on it. Um, but still, I probably will end up opening up that hole to give it more slop or possibly opening up all the holes just to give it just a little more leeway. Also, this might not be a problem because these bars are actually made slightly differently than these longer bars. So that's why these are all sort of crunched in a little bit. So when I take these off and I replace them with these and then put some new bar here, that should fix it. But right now I have only made these, so I'll just leave it like this to equilibrate. Okay, so now I've attached the wires for the manager. I'm just gonna, I'm just assembling this really quickly because I just wanna check the batteries out to make sure the system works and the manager works. So I'm just kludging it together quickly just to turn it on. Then I will make nicer, a uh, nice bar here for this part and then these will be more straight and everything else will be nice. But first I just wanna turn it on and see how it charges and discharges. Okay, I've now set up a battery manager here. It's a small one, kind of undersized for this battery pack, but I'm just going to check it out. And, and I just temporarily hacked this together just so I can test it. Then I'm going to uh, test charge it and uh, see how it works. Okay, so I have uh, temporarily spliced it in parallel with my other battery. And it's uh, charging away. So this uh, charger is running at 15 amps. This second charger is doing 16 amps. There's like 30 amps combined going into those two parallel batteries. And it's pretty much charged up to 16.5 volts. Seems to be fine. So the next stage is I'm going to clean it up some and then install it permanently.